Electro reception in sharks. It is well known sharks' capability to detect a drop of blood in the ocean, but few know that they can also detect prey hidden under the sand. For this, they do not use the sense of smell, but other sense called electroreception, which also use the platypus, the echidna, and the elephant fish. Electroreception is nothing more than the ability to detect electric fields that all living beings generate when they move. Water is better electrical conductor than air, so it is clearly useful in aquatic animals. In sharks, electroreceptor organs are the ampullae of Lorenzini, which you may notice if you carefully look the shark head in a photograph. They are found around the mouth and appear as small dark spots but they are channels filled with a gelatinous substance capable of conducting electrical signals, which end in a pore. Some have hundreds, but others, like hammerhead sharks, have thousands of ampullae of Lorenzini. The first time someone made public the presence of these structures in sharks was in 1678, when Italian anatomist Stefano Lorenzini described its composition although it was not until the 20th century when its function was defined. The way the ampullae of Lorenzini works is simple, it detects the voltage difference between the skin pore and the base of the channel filled with gel, which is in contact with sensory cells and these, in turn, are connected with nerves that transmit electrical impulses to the brain. Let's consider the following example. When a small fish swims, it moves its tail fin from side to side. The muscle movement generates electrical signals that travel through water. If a hungry shark swims by, the signals reach its ampullae of Lorenzini and go through the gelatinous channel until the brain process such information, and then the shark can know where the fish is. Sharks are the most electrically sensitive animals known. They can detect electrical signals as weak as 15,000 millionths of a volt, even if the movement comes from the heartbeat. There is only a slight problem. Many telecommunication cables are installed underwater and sharks bite them as they detect their electric field, so many companies have to protect them to avoid this. Follow us in the social networks. Twitter. Facebook, YouTube, Pinterest, Google+, SoundCloud and others. For more information visit bioexpedition.com.